Welcome back, everybody. It's Conger Live with a Sad Panda Cub. In our Golden League Team Wars Battle Days, we got the Goth Kids deck. We were able to get Sharon to five, and we were able to get Ink and Craig to three, Tally to four, Professor Chaos to four, and Labar Jimmy to six. So I'm pretty excited about what we're going to be able to come up against in this. Now, obviously, we didn't level up the new legendary card because no one's got her past one. Maybe someone's got her at two if they got lucky. Um, but she should still be able to do, Henrietta that is, should still be able to put in some work. Um, just gonna have fun this week with these new cards, the goth kids. I'm not goth, so since I'm using the goth kids you can call me a big poser. Uh, just a poser, right? But we're gonna have fun with this. Alright, I guess I'm gonna start with Sharon in the back. Hopefully I can get uh, Henrietta out there pretty soon. Let's go ahead and general disarray that. Um, we're going to transmogrify her. We do not want Sharon on the enemy team. We do not want that at all. Ooh, yep, we're going to have to lose our Sharon there. That's no good. Um, Professor Chaos to freeze, stopping the damage from happening. And will he be able to take out Mr. Mackey? Yes, he will. All right, but of course, the opponents, Professor Chaos, uh, not Professor Chaos, uh, General Disarray, Lava is going to stop him from getting in to get any damage. So we're kind of null at the moment. Um, we're going to slow play Towley once we get to 10. And there we go. Nice. We've got... Oh, they got their tally as well. Okay. Hmm. I'm gonna go ahead and have Ink and Craig blast these guys, see what kind of damage we can get in there. Um, I'm gonna throw... Oh, and then now we have, we have the goth kids ready to go. So I wanna get that energy staff out there. Just kind of let things play out at the moment so we can get some energy back but I do want to wait till I'm near the top okay we're gonna play that energy staff and then we're gonna play Michael first because Michael makes them immune to spells um, unfortunately we'll put Michael down here and then we're gonna throw Henrietta in the back so we'll play her and we're gonna send Burkle after I'm throw this in here. It'd be nice to get Pete out, but I think that um, definitely better off with Yes, oh it wasn't fast enough. That is a bummer. Get that heal. And even though we didn't lose the phone, things do not look that great for us. Oh well hey, that's not bad. Let's see what else they end up playing. I guess I'm going to put Pete down because he's able to heal himself. And then throw Furkle so Pete can get some extra No bueno. No bueno. That's it. Okay, that was tough. Um, Energy Staff is a great card, but at a, only level three and being a four cost, I don't really know if it gives us much energy over the long term. Um, maybe I should have just went straight into the Goth Kids rather than doing that, because I, I don't think it really helped me out much. Um, I know it's used in a lot of top tier decks, so that could have been a big mistake of mine. Also, maybe instead of Throwing out Sharon, I should have thrown out Pete earlier on. Um, once again, if I had not bothered to play the energy staff, maybe I could have gotten Pete right out right away. Um, General Disarray is definitely uh, annoying because that that lava back by your kid really messes messes things up. I would have liked to play my General Disarray. They got that flying Kyle, they had both 
That's why I'm wondering, like, where where was our flying units? We didn't we don't have any. So they have both the kite and Terrence. I love Terrence. So I know that those are probably like Pete and and uh, what's her face trade-offs. So kind of tough. We're gonna just dump Furkle. Pete some uh, extra attack there. Fortunately, we're down big time. Uh, It's tough using the goth kids with them being at such low levels. Um, I think that's kind of our biggest challenge here. The uh, Mimsy being uh, common, a lot of people have them at a much higher level than the Henrietta um, option there. So that may have been, the, the goth kids may have been the bad call. I was kind of hoping we were gonna see a bunch of other people using them just because they're new. I know in the past we've been resistant to using the new cards because most people don't have them at the right level, and that's kind of what we're seeing here. Um, so do the best you can, guys. Have fun with it, right? Um, we also don't have the best cycling, a lot of four drops, so it's not like we can get to those um, to combo the, the goth kids together. And being that Henrietta is only level one, she ended up dying pretty quickly when I the one game the game one where I was able to play her. So uh, we'll see. Uh, we're we're zero and two, um, not exciting uh, so far, but we still have a chance to turn this around. You never know who you're going to get matched up with. If they're going to be someone who is in a full guild with tons of caps, so they got high levels, or if they're going to be in a half full guild like what we're in. Um, because the nice thing about not being in the in a full guild is that everyone in our bracket, our, our five team bracket, they all have about the same amount of players we do. But the people you get matched up with could be coming from any guild. So that's what makes it tough when you're coming from a guild with only half a roster. So we have less caps to allocate than uh, someone who's say in a full guild. Now this guy is around the same ability level as me. So it's nice that we start off with the staff but he also starts off with the staff so and I don't think Jenner Disarray targets the staff. We're gonna go ahead and throw Tally in here and we're gonna throw Furkle and Pete. And as I get Michael in there too. So all I need is Henrietta. <clears throat> so I got the whole goth kids. I'd love to get Henrietta out before Furkle dies so we can get some resurrection happening. Um, that's not gonna happen. Uh, we'll get resurrection on the others. Oh, we did get her. We did get her just in time. Wonderful. She didn't get the... Um... So now we have a chance to kind of make things happen with their resurrection and then they're getting the health. Fortunately, Henrietta just dies way too quickly. Um, we are going to general disarray into that tally to kind of help give our guys some momentum and kind of tie that slowing down effect. Nelly just wasting them. Great placement. Not the most ideal card to use to stop her because of the cost and also because of, and if she's close enough to hit my new kid, no. That's good. Um, it looks like she hit, did hit him one time. I'm gonna have to use Sharon to fight off. Not gonna survive that, oh, bummer. Once again, these, this is the way that things have kind of been going. Um, play Tally, don't wanna take any hits there. Oh wow, that is absolutely obnoxious. Um, I put him just in, <sighs> resurrect, uh, Regeneration on Professor Chaos at level four, level four epic. Pretty, uh, 
pretty pretty insane there. Um, that it was enough to to stop that. Unfortunately, when I placed Tally, he was still slightly in uh, the what's it called the uh, the lava, which was not what I wanted. So it made it to where he wasn't able to attack at a regular speed back at. So we're gonna lose it. Can't, not even gonna get a, a single phone in there. That's, a, that's unfortunate. Um, of course, trying to use the goth kid combos. Not very strong at level one, uh, level at basic levels. We got level one, two, three, four for those cards, and they kind of clutter the deck. So. Um, like I said, just have fun this week, guys. I don't even think I got a single phone, so I think I put up a donut. Um, but it's okay. I uh, wanted to, you know, get a chance to use those guys. Yeah, zero. You know why it's a zero? Because the goth kids are a bunch of losers. At least this time, it makes us a sad panda. All right, guys, give us a like. Give us a subscribe. Uh, if you want to see more of these weekly Team Wars videos, I'm also covering Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Mutant Madness. Uh, that's been a lot of fun for me to cover, um, and I hope that there will be more content uh, coming. Thanks again, and game smarter. You're a towel. That makes me a sad panda.